This has been produced by umunu.com. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, 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 welcome. Yeah! <laughs> to another exciting episode of the Joe Blow Conspiracy Show. I'm your host, Joe Blow, and uh, we go through lots of, uh, it's another one of them uh, potpourri, you know, mixed up, lots of different shit uh, show. Uh, in the first part of the show, I'm going to be going uh, over uh, Alex Jones, uh, the situation news about him. And then uh, later, uh, we play a phone call where Chronic uh, calls up the White House. And uh, it was pretty, uh, you know, it, you, you really enjoyed that. And remember, Chronic's website is uh, wakethefuckup.info or wtfu.net. And then uh, after that, uh, you know, Scorpio, he wanted to call someone, so he called uh, RV Wolfpack and, you know, talked shit about Ron Paul being a Freemason. And then Scorpio calls Eric Huffschmidt, but the main part of the show is where I call Eric Huffschmidt's female stalker. It, she is batshit crazy, let me tell you. <laughs> Gives you, like, insight into the Eric Huffschmidt. Oh, man, that, it was like... Uh, Really great. I mean, that uh, uh, first, let's hear what uh, you know. You know, I've been fucking around with Alex Jones lately, especially after the previous episode. And then, like, uh, AJ, like, you know, as usual, calls everyone like, uh, you know, a white supremacist, uh, you know, uh, co intel pro. And like, uh, uh, it's kind of funny. This time he said, like, uh, I'm gonna end up like Timothy McVeigh, you know, from Oklahoma City bombings. So, once you listen, it, it was quite humorous. It's all run by them. And notice the biggest group attacking me. Telling all these lies, making things up about me, manufacturing completely fake, made-up garbage. Saying I work for Israel or I work for the Pope or I work for this or that. I don't work for any of those people but Alex Jones and the Constitution. Look at the fruits that we've bore. Look at the people we've woken up. Look at what we've done. And I have ridden this razor edge trying to stay afloat, trying to operate, trying to stop infiltration, trying to stop the attempted setups, the physical attacks, the stuff I don't spend a lot of time on. I mean, I am a warrior, ladies and gentlemen. I am committed to this fight, and I'm committed wherever it leads me. I'm ready for whatever they do to me. Listen to all you Nazi handlers out there. 
They'll blow up a building and say, you did it later. It doesn't matter if you're an FBI agent like Turner or an informant. Tim McVeigh, it's now sworn in federal court, was what we told you he was, black ops, super secret, national security. They set him up and drugged his butt up and executed his butt. Told him he'll murder your family if you don't keep your mouth shut. All of you people serving this and all of you that are paid to attack me, you're not having success. People now know who you are. And so to all the COINTELPRO, we've identified you. And they are discussing and threatening to use white supremacists to kill me right now. Whatever happens, happens. If the feds kill me, they kill me. <laughs> oh man, that is so funny, dude. <laughs> That's having Coentel Pro call you Coentel Pro. Man, you the biggest fucking like so obvious agent, man. You getting like that boost from the ADL shit, man, and like um I'm a motherfucker. Uh, how could you be, um, what do you call, alternative if you're, like, on Drudge Report, they, you have that link to InfoWars. Man, you're part of the mainstream, bitch. And let me remind y'all why I attacked Alex Jones, because, like, um, he was trying to get rid of, uh, you know, Michael Collins Piper, you know, from uh, Republic Broadcasting Network, and, you know, trying to ruin his uh, career, and, like, poor Piper, man, and, like, he was gonna, that was gonna hurt him, like, personally in life, I'd have, like, um, stepped to the plate and, like, um, uh, you know, teach fucking AJ a lesson, but, like, he, no, but guess what happened, man? Immediately afterwards, he uh, he started acting shitty again because what do you do? He turns around recently and, and like tries to destroy another radio host career, Jack Blood. I mean, this, he's been fucking with Jack Blood like forever. I mean, Jack Blood he, he even says he got taped that like AJ just trying to call like the uh, you know radio stations. Uh, 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 manager and saying like don't play Jack Blood or you don't get to play no AJ man I would be like I take this compliment I'd be like thank you I don't want to play any fucking Infowars shit <laughs> no man see um, and uh, Jack Blood that's another guy he uh, see like uh, unfortunately for Jack Blood man I like Michael Collins Piper more so I had to like help out uh, Piper my man uh, but uh, you know Jack Blood you know if you ever need any help if you want to come on the show and tell the truth about AJ you come on saying like you got like the secret information man you need to like um come to the Joe Blow conspiracy show and just spill your guts and shit but uh I, I mean it's it, not just that look at another thing like AJ's doing man like uh, he there's this uh, uh demonstration in Austin Texas and like uh, you know they're having a great time they organized it perfectly a bunch of people were you know they had a guest and host and like everybody was like yay we're gonna we need to do this I don't remember what the fuck it was about I think it was some you know pro gun rights and then like uh, it was going great but then AJ comes waddling in actually wearing a business suit I don't even know why <laughs> And then, like, uh, he, he like uh, he he starts yelling in his microphone like over you know, louder than the speakers at the podium, and like uh, uh, people were shocked. They were like, "Hey, AJ, what the fuck is this?" I mean, like, and then like this one lady said, "Like, hey, AJ, man, why are you ruining our demonstration?" And like, AJ was uh, you know picking a fight with a woman. Man, so fucking shameful. <laughs> you gotta see this, the videos are everywhere. I mean, everybody attacked AJ for this. Even John Statmiller, man. RBN, they put it like a page on, uh, you know, republicbroadcasting.org. They say like, man, AJ fucks up a demonstration. And then like, uh, John Statmiller had to take Friday off because, you know, you know, AJ like called Statmiller to his office because, you know, AJ asked like something over John Statmiller. I don't know. I respect John Statmiller. Mr. Statmiller, you know, I'm a proud supporter of you and your fine network. Uh, if you got any intel on AJ, you know my address. Joe Blow at umunu.com. You give me that, I'll rip his ass apart for you, man. Because uh, everybody needs to, like, uh, 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 you know, take down this AJ monster. He's, like, a um, big detriment and shit. I mean, <laughs> I mean, uh, you know, even the people who, like, so called uh, support him, like Dr. Deagle on his own or GCN radio network, Garbage Can Network, uh, they're even fucking up AJ inadvertently. What? <laughs> I mean, you gotta listen to yourself. We're gonna play a clip right now of uh, Deagle, so called helping out AJ. <laughs> 
Bëthën kur ta prejt Ndoshta kime tenk, ndoshta ma bon kime hek Rëshlir, se ki bëthën e mirë Vesh në 